So, did you print your name on the screen? Did you like it? Now let's print some more. In the previous video, we wrote code to print one statement. So how do we print many statements? Let's do that now. I'm going to print an introduction about myself. So last time I told you my name is Anil. So let's write that first. So I write print, open the bracket, close the bracket, single quotes, and I write my name is Ani. Okay, and then I write one more print statement, which is print, open the bracket, close the bracket, single quotes. I like to teach students to code. Now let's save the file and run the code. So this is good. So we have printed this, but there is also one more way to print many statements instead of writing two statements. So let me show you how to do that. For that, we are going to use a plus sign. So let me write again, print, open the bracket within single quotes, my name is Ani. Now, after this, I'm going to put a plus sign and now write again within single quotes, I like to teach students to code. Now save the file and run the code. As you can see from the output, we can use plus sign to print many sentences together. But does this look good? No, because we would have wanted to show the second sentence in the second line. So how do we do that? We do it using slash n. So how do I, where do I place that? So we have these two sentences. My name is Ani and I like to teach kids to code. So in between that, I'm going to add within single quotes slash n and then another plus sign. Now let me save the file and run the code. Now we get the same output in two lines. So my name is Ani is printed on the first line slash n tells Python to go to the next line and then print the second sentence which is I like to teach students to code. How will we print a third line? Can you pause the video and try that on your own? So I can use a plus and a slash n to add another line like this. So in the same print statement, let me add the third line. So I put a plus and then I put a slash n within single quotes and then I put a plus and then within single quotes I write I live in Bangalore. Now save the file and run the code. Now that we have seen two methods to write the print statement can you print an introduction about yourself? So the second exercise in this series is to write a code to print your name, what class you're studying and what are your hobbies. Please write the code and I will see you in the next video.